Hello again. I'm Peter Alsop, and this is my Songs to Chew podcast. Every week we listen to a song, mostly mine, but sometimes we chew on songs written by other people. And then we take a look at the messages and ideas that are in the songs, especially ideas that people have found to be valuable or useful. Some songs have big ideas in them about how to help each other get through problems or puzzles we face in our day-to-day lives. Sometimes there are little ideas, like figuring out how things work so we can accomplish tasks or learn lessons that help us understand how to do what we already do, but just a little better. Some are sad, some are silly, and just plain fun. Well, today's song comes from my Take Me With You album. It's called Hey Everybody, and it's about how, when we want to master something, we usually have to do it over and over and over again until we've mastered it. And then we're so happy that we can do it, and we work so hard to learn it, that we want to show everybody what we can do. So, here's our song to chew for today. Hey, everybody. Hey, everybody. I learned to whistle all on my own. Now here I go. I had to try it again and again. Put your lips like this, then blow. Come on. I learned to all on my own So listen to me My finger goes on top of my thumb Then I snap it quick as can be oh, All right Now you got it Hey everybody I learned to yodel all on my own So plug up your ears Sing along regular, then sing up high, then wiggle your throat and change gears. <laughs> hey everybody, I learned to... All on my own, it's my favorite bit Stick your tongue out through your lips Then give it a blow with no spit Here we go Put my finger into my mouth Feel the pressure and it's free Hey everybody, I learned to All on my own, here's how you go Hold your tongue on the roof of your mouth Then sing with a buzz through the hole Hey everybody, I learned to hand drive all on my own I'll play for you, slap your knee, your hand, your knee Then the same on your other knee too Here we go, okay now I can't do this by myself because I'm driving So that's good, you do it We learn something all on our own And it's something new all at the same time Let's do something different Let's see what each other can do Now think something up, here we go The kids who sang with us on this song were mostly kids from Topanga Canyon in California, where we live, and my kids, Willow and Megan, when they were little. Most of you can probably remember when you were little. 
how difficult it was to learn new things like walking or whispering or snapping your fingers. It really feels great when we can finally do something we've been working on. And feeling good about ourselves is one of the most important things we can do for ourselves. It gives us strength. It keeps our spirits up. It encourages us to try to get better and better, and that's healthy for our heart and our mind and our spirit. When we learn something new, of course, we're a little clumsy or awkward when we begin. But as we keep trying, practicing every day, we get better at what we do. And that helps us feel good about ourselves. It builds our self-worth. And as little kids, our job is mostly to learn mastery over our body. And once we get that mastery and we practice it over and over, then we get it into our heads and our bodies that since we learned how to whistle a tune, we can also probably learn to whistle another different one, maybe more difficult, or with some flourishes. Yeah, right. And then maybe someday we could learn to play a clarinet or a flute or the guitar. Because once we gain a little confidence... That helps us keep going and learning more and more, and we master more things, not just our body, but also our excited and adventurous spirits. We start learning ways to appreciate and control our emotional selves, and we learn skills about how to work with other people, and we just get better at everything the more we practice. When I use a song with kids, I ask them to think of something that they don't know how to do very well yet, like whistling or popping their mouth, balancing on one foot, and then we practice doing it again and again, until we get a little tiny bit better at it. And then we need to practice it for at least five minutes every day. Sometimes it's a good idea to find someone who can already do what you want to learn and ask them for advice. People usually love to give advice. And sometimes, even when we don't seem to be getting any better, it helps to keep on trying and practicing. Because then we think of little ways to change what it is we're doing, even just a little bit, until we make it work for ourselves. Can you think of something that was very hard for you to learn, but then you finally learned it? Do you remember how you finally figured it out? Because if you can remember how you did it that time, the same way might help you the next time you feel stuck. And the more that you're successful, the more you like yourself. Liking ourselves is one of the most important things in the world. It gives us strength to go on. It helps us stay healthy. It's called having a good sense of self-worth. Learning new things is always a little clumsy and awkward. If we keep trying and practice each day, we get better at what we do. When we say, I can't do it, we limit what we can accomplish. So when we hear ourselves saying that, it helps to add the word yet to the sentence. I can't do it yet. As little kids, when we gain mastery over our bodies, we build self-confidence in being able to tackle other more difficult tasks. This song delights in the playfulness of discovering what we can do and sharing it with others. It also models the use of affirmations, which is when we give compliments to others or to ourselves and notice that we're doing something that we couldn't do before. It's saying it out loud. Wow, we're getting better at this. It's something we wanted to learn how to do, and now we're doing it. Hooray! Okay, that's enough chewing on this song for today. I'm Peter Alsop. I'm glad you stopped by. Maybe you'd like to bring a friend next week. Then we could chew on another song together. And even after I go, you two could keep chewing on the song without me. I'll see you next week for another song to chew. Bye for now.